Since I was about 15 or 16, I realised well, I had the ability to start kicking a few longer range goals and in school. Probably some of my longer range kicks are around the halfway mark. So when I line my kicks up, I, I, um, I always aim the ball for the right post. I have a natural right to left curl on my kick, so if I aim it there, it normally ends up around in the middle if I hit it properly. And my run up is three steps back and two across. And I just put my feet where they feel comfortable. Take a pretty good look at the post and get a target in behind. Not necessarily on the post, but something in behind on the on the uh, on the hill and swing through. When I'm at the top of my run, I I um, sort of just imagine the ball the flight of the ball and where I want the ball to sort of track the path and um, where I want it to land and yeah, hopefully hit it sweetly and hope for the result. Uh, last year was my first season at Brothers playing Premier Grade. And um, one of the better games we had was against Jeeps, old boys day here. Yeah, I remember the game specifically, um, Jeeps, you know, they, they came out firing and um, they got, a, got away to a good start with a few early tries from uh, one of their wingers, Chris Kurandrani. Scored a try just before half time um, on a counter attack. Got put away into a good hole and found a little bit of space and scored under the post. And um, in the second half, we again we played some pretty good footy and um, we exited out of our own territory pretty well through our full back pierce for today. <laughs> Thank you.
regrets, baby, who I am today I was when I should've stayed There were times when I shouldn't have looked away Those regrets, some mistakes, and regrets, baby, who I am So we found ourselves in the knockout semi last year and we came up against Jeeps again at Ballymore and um, it was a pretty physical game and in the end we, we probably didn't do enough to, to win but um, we lost by a couple of points and it was a really tight game. We've had a really good pre-season this year, we've, we've been training um, three or four times a week including um, off-field sessions and um, the past couple of weeks we've had a few tough trials and we've got a pretty good gauge at where we're at and um, we've, we've got a few new combinations this year with our back line and just a few new players coming into the side. Pre-season's given me a pretty good opportunity to, to prepare my body. I had a few niggling injuries last year, particularly in my shoulder, so I definitely got on top of those this year, just in the gym and doing some off-field stuff. And um, yeah, looking forward to playing this year injury-free. One of the main areas I'm really looking to improve on is just contact area of the game and particularly defence, just making sure I can make those low tackles when the opportunity arises. We're five days out from our first round, first round this year, um, and we're away playing West. It's a lot different to a trial game. Um, it'll be much more physical and um, boys will be really looking to make a statement this weekend and I think It'll be a pretty pretty tough game of footy knowing Wes in the past um, really come out firing and um, really target you with the breakdown. I think one thing that we can probably take out of last year was just key moments. We probably, we probably missed out on a few big opportunities and big games.